I've wanted a computer here in the shop for a long time and the quickest and easiest solution would be to just go buy a laptop. But I don't really want to spend the money on a laptop when I do have all the parts available to build another computer. So that's what I did. I threw together just a very simple Linux computer that I'm going to use out here in the shop. I just want to make a cart for it now. Something small and compact and something that I could use all of my scraps for and hopefully not spend any money. I know I have enough 3 quarter inch pine plywood and I've got these two um, L-shaped legs that were a failure on another project but should just be alright for this one. And these casters are actually the original casters that came with my Harbor Freight dust collector a couple of years ago and I never ever installed them so they've just been sitting around waiting for use and I actually just found them so they may be a little bit overkill for this but uh, they'll do the job just fine. So the legs are left over from another project and they're going to be great for this except they're a little too tall. I want the height of these to be at about elbow level. To keep things simple, I'm just going to use glue and brad nails. I'll glue on a couple of these brackets to make sure everything stays nice and square. And finally the middle shelf the same way. The computer is going to sit on this middle shelf and I'll secure it to the center board that the monitor will attach to. The monitor does have a stand but I don't want to use the stand. Instead I want to use the included mounting locations on the back side of the monitor. Finish him. Get over here! I ended up having to move the back casters further back because when the casters were in this position, they were actually centered a little bit to the front of this back leg, which made it kind of tip back. But moving them back three inches completely solved that. Flawless victory. So this turned out way better than I thought it would. I thought it was just going to be an ugly scrap wood cart, but instead I've got a 
paroxysm of joy at how well this thing turned out. We should all use overly complicated words to describe our projects from now on. So for example, upon commencing this expeditious cart project, you will implement a processes to ameliorate your supernumerary wood accumulation. So basically what I was saying is you can use scrap wood to make this cart. And if you'd like some more detailed information on this cart, then check out the link in the description below. And if you'd like to show your support for what I do without spending a dime, then sharing and commenting on anything on my website goes a long way in really showing your support. It really does help. This project is gonna get a lot of use for me here in the shop, and quite honestly, it would be very difficult for me to run a CNC machine in here if I didn't have a computer in here. Choose your destiny. Toasty!